guys and girls, welcome back to Jolly Lads Gaming with myself, Aaron, one third of the Jolly Lads Gaming Trio, and welcome back to Dark Souls. Uh, we return to the adventures of Jolly Badger. It's been about four days, I think, since I've actually uploaded Dark Souls, but I've been doing quite a lot of Kingdom Hearts, but um, but it's here, we're back, so it's all good. I'd just like to point out that if you are watching from the UK, well, if you're watching from my part of the UK, somewhere in Essex, you'll know it is pretty damn hot today. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I'm I'm literally sweating as I'm recording this, but that's probably TMI for you guys. <laughs> anyway, when we last left off, we de absolutely destroyed the Bell Gargoyles, with the help of Solaire, of course. And now, we're actually gonna head back to the Undead Berg. So, let's, let's proceed. See, we have one humanity, and we we are human as well, which means potentially we can be invaded. Oh, those guys die in one shot now. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. I parried at the wrong time. There we go. We Estus up. There's not much danger of us um, running out of Estus flasks by the time we get to the Undead Berg bonfire. and get stabbed by my claymore. Oh, you dropped an item. Cracked round shield. That's something that tells me it's not gonna be as good as what I've got now. Kill Mr. Rat. Splash through the spluers. <laughs> through the spluers. The skewers. Skew. Where is skeleton? Even though they're not scared of the Oh, blimey. He's a bit hyped up, isn't he? Yeah, I know where the enemies are off by heart pretty much now. Face them so many times. Up the stairs. Be wary of undead. Even though I've got a more powerful weapon, I, I am still going to lure them to me, just in case things go really wrong. And... Oh, I, I was about to say something else. Like, I thought I'd done lots of shortcuts to get back to the Berg Bonfire, but... Um, no, you can't actually get there straight from the shrine. This is actually the quickest way, so... So, it's all good. And they're dead. Right, now we have quite a few souls to actually spend here. So I think we are going to level up a few times. Uh, we can potentially level up about, I reckon, about five times here, I reckon. So we'll put one in strength. We'll put two into vitality. One into endurance. Ah. Hmm, okay, we can only level up four times, but do we have any souls of undead? Let us have a look. Large shot with a nameless soldier. How many does that get us? A thousand. Ooh. No, we still don't have enough. Well, that's alright. Um, four levels isn't too bad. I think we're on level 21 now, so... Yeah, that's pretty good, I've got to say. Just, um, oh, I thought I'd, uh, I thought I'd kindled that. But to be honest, I think I actually will whilst I'm... <laughs> that was close. I think I actually will while I'm here. Just so we can get those 10 Estus. Because the next boss we are going to face, we're going to face him quite shortly, 
can be quite tricky. Not quite as terrifyingly tricky as the Bell Gargoyles, I would say, but he can be problematic, and you'll see why when we actually get there. Oh, the roll didn't actually work there. They are dealt with. Does not open. Ah, okay. Uh, I'm just trying to think how I get in there, actually. Through. Hmm. I don't think I can get in there for some time. Oh no, I do know, yeah, I know one way we can go with where we can kind of avoid that problem. We just have to keep going through the berg, though. Oh. Hooray, we've got a hollow warrior waist cloth. Oh, they have never jumped down there before. they're dealt with. Can... is that... Mm, is that waist cloth going to weigh us down too much? No, that's fine. Though we do look a little bit strange, I have to admit. What about the gauntlets? No, see the gauntlets weigh us down too much. Well, I guess we'll just have to stick with what we've got for the time being. At least until we unlock another sword I reckon. For the time being we are going to stick with a claymore but yeah I do want to get my strength up a little bit. Uh, oh jeez, black firebomb. Oh, wasted black firebomb. He's dead. Parry the spearmen please. There we go. Stab through the stomach. Blood. Oh, oh, damn it, I forgot about that guy. We'll be alright. Just gotta keep going, keep on pressing through. Um No, fine. I'll show you guys what's down here now. I've got a decent weapon and fairly decent strength in that. We might be able to survive, potentially. And, oh yeah, I don't have any gold pine resin left. Damn it. Try stabbing in the back. That's a clue for how to take this next enemy down. I shall show you. This, ladies and gentlemen, Yeah, we're, uh, we're not going to do that. That, ladies and gents, is Havel. <laughs> very nasty enemy. It, very, very nasty enemy. That dragon tooth that he holds, when you get that as an actual weapon in game, I think it has 300 damage. Or something silly like that. So, yeah, we're not going to bother with him for some time, I think. I hate it when they do that. Come on, I don't have all day. There you go. So I've kind of got to look on the bright side. I can't be invaded anymore by accident. Right, there they're with. He won't drop it, no. Whoa! 
that was not good. There you go. Yeah, I might as well just cut through here actually. Maybe I can actually get them from here. Oh, I can. No. Can't get many more. Come on. Come on. I don't have all day. Get over here, shitbag. Oh, that's a problem. Not, not so much problem anymore. Right, let's go and get our souls back, I suppose. Right, thank God we can we can get our souls back there. So. Can't actually follow us back up. Right, so we just got to proceed through the berg as I said. Uh, not too much further now until we get to our little um, uh, our little transition area, if you like. Get up there. This, of course, where we fought the Taurus demon. He is no more. Go and bother with those crossbow guys, I don't think. They're no threat. Whew, I'm I am so so hot. Like genuinely it's ridiculous. I can't even turn the fan on because it kind of interferes with the mic. Now, let's open this door. I believe we got that basement key from the undead parish. Climb down the ladder. Nice and quickly. And go up these stairs, up these stairs, and these stairs, and look where we are folks, just at the end of that bridge. So oh, where did these come from? Well, they're dead now, but yeah, we have unlocked a shortcut to kind of the kind of half next area I suppose shortcut yeah we are now in the lower undead berg a lot nastier than the upper undead berg in that we take our first dark souls dogs in this area they can be notoriously annoying to fight But they're dead now. Right. Let's see what's down here. That looks like that door Somebody. can be opened. Please let me out of here. Somebody. Hello? Anybody. Help me. Unlock the door. Damn. Unlock. I'm finished. How did this ever happen? But how did this ever happen? Do we have the key? Residence key. See? Told you we'd need that. There's a guy in a barrel. Oh, sorcerer set. Very nice. And the catalyst. Beautiful. Brilliant. You opened the door for me. We Thank didn't do it for you, which word the sorcerer set. Saved. I thought I might never escape. I am Griggs of Vinheim, a sorcerer Griggs. of the school. I am much obliged for your assistance. Thanks to you, I may now resume my travels. It's not a particularly fan fancy name, is it? Griggs. Oh, hello. I'm fine. I will rest a while, then return to Firelink Shrine. I have my sorcery. And I will be more cautious next time. Besides, I have an important task at hand. 
Well, good for you, Griggs. I hope your journey back to the shrine goes safely. Right now. Oh, that's a lot of hollows. They're not gonna... They're not gonna come? Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, fine, I'll come to them. Oh. Yeah, you don't want to get hit by that fire. It can be quite damaging. Twin humanities. Essentially exactly the same as normal humanities, except you get two of them, guys. I did not realise this area was inside. Strange. Anyway, doesn't seem to be anything else in here. Let's press on. Barrow. Doesn't seem to be anything in there. Uh, get in there. No, apparently not. And, ooh. Yeah, there are enemies in some of these doors, folks. Wonder if I can... No, no, I can't get him. Yep, new type of enemy, guys. These are thieves. Very quick, very... Agile and they can make you believe oh. that. Oh no! <laughs> I think that's only. Oh no, 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 Oh, seriously? Uh, that's, well, that's just silly, isn't it? Oh, come on, let's just go back through. I'm just going to ignore these guys until I get down to the bottom, I think. Actually, you know what? I'll just let this guy follow me. Come on. You're dealt with. Okay, let's try that again, shall we? With preferably without being stabbed this time. Come on, third dog. Yeah, see, that's why those dogs can be annoying. They tend to jump around all over the place. Right. Oh, right, okay, they're out this time. I don't get how they can interrupt that attack, either. Peace off! Seriously, you idiots! Oh, you idiots. Oh, we'll end the episode there, guys. If you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like, share and subscribe. And we'll be back soon for more fun. Bye.